bandit, master key, this time blue actually is optional. Alright, let's pick up the key, as if there was anything else to do. Ignore the bonfire, do you honestly think we have time for petty shit? Again, ignore. You might need this later, you know, if you are disabled. Fuck <laughs> this motherfucker, and pick up this axe. Do the inventory thing, to make it look like you know what you are fucking doing. Giant iron balls hate him. Learn this one trick. If he is dying, why not use the Estus he just gave me? Let's assume you are less retarded than I am. <laughs> Chances are you can get a shorter time than me if the game stops fucking about with you. Now you have dealt with that, keep hammering X at the door. Okay, it's time to get moving. Pick this up, now. Do not waste time by picking up the rest of the irrelevant garbage strewn about here. Grab this. Flex on this guy, hoopsie. You didn't see that. Pick this up. Can you believe you need to sit at the bonfire right away, otherwise a skeleton will come and fuck your shit up. Now you can pop it, and now you can go human. Also why the fuck is Shiva just hanging out? Some more speedrunner things, to make it appear like I know what I'm doing. Picking up soul packets, like a homeless guy picks up change. Now, prepare to witness something fucking incredible. Honestly, I should have died, you should have died, Lobos Jr. should have died. Grab the shield for extra speed, and flex on that black knight for good measure. Some more fucking soul packets. Drop down here, killing the frog is optional. I promise you this soul packet is necessary. Walk through the cummies wall first, that way you can make a fast exit after you steal the tree's money. Now, we need to hope beyond all hope, that this specific Beatrice, was not dropped on her fucking head as a child. Jesus fucking Christ, that was painful. I swear I'm equipping the shield because I want to make it fair on the boss and mid-roll, not because it one-shot me in my previous attempt. I'm literally stunned that Beatrice actually managed to do something for once in her miserable bastard life. Bone back to the shrine and level up, it's time to do pinwheel motherfucker. I swear, if this fucking skeleton hits me one more time instead of jumping past me, I'm going to shoot up an old folks home. Sadly, all you can do at this point is hope the skeletons don't block the exit to this room. It seems to happen at random. If they do, take your anger out on a small child. Remember to take the time to have a little sip of the jungle juice, or else this fall will fucking kill you. Now grab one of the items I forgot to mention in the guide. Be efficient, summon Leroy first, and then pick up the soul packet, do it with confidence, that way if anyone is watching you, they will think you know what you are fucking doing, pray to god you do not get mown down like a bitch to the wheel skeletons. Let Leroy do literally all of the fucking work here, remember to grab this little hidden nugget of a soul packet, seriously without this the run would not even be half as easy, now all we have to do is mop up the rest of the soul packets around Firelink Shrine. Murder this stupid fucking bastard in cold blood. Do not worry, I'm not going to judge you for it. Finally the last step of this run. Sadly it involves going to this shit heap. Send feminism back 120 years by killing a woman because it's more convenient. Ha, you literally gotcha. have the choice of collecting 3 soul packets in here and killing Petrus. Or, kill both the Taurus demon and Capra demon. What a tough choice. Pop the rest of the soul packets and there you go motherfucker. Level 30, killing only 2 bosses, and before you have even looked at a bell, be proud of yourself. So, who is this video for I hear you ask? Well, it's certainly not for PC players, but, if you are on console, and you fancy some low level PvP, or, just a quick boost of power to your early game, and, you also have some retarded moral objection to cheating, then look no further. Here is a quick and easy method of getting to level 30, in under 25 minutes, that anyone can do, the easiest way possible. 
for any skill level aside from, immediately after birth I was swung about the room from my umbilical cord. There is a Patreon link in the description you shitheads, so do something worthwhile for once in your pathetic life.